this is kind of a snapshot of uh, the, the different types of investments that we offer. Um, many of them have been around for many years. Rain Tree in general is fairly conservative. Uh, we like investments that have been around for a long time. Some of them are newer, certainly. Um, anyway, and it's many of them are real estate based, which is how I kind of find a home really, or, or I'm, a, I'm a good compliment to many people that are real estate investors because they understand real estate as an investment. So to summarize, so what can we actually expect? When are the rates going to be cut? Okay, so if we look at January next week, uh, we are not likely to see an increase. It is probably going to, we won't see the increase, but it's not going to go up. It will most likely stay the course. Now, in March, um, prior to this report, the money markets um, were predicting, based on their movements, uh, an odds of, an, of a cut of about 40%. After yesterday's report came out, that dropped to about 30%. So those are not high odds right now that we're going to see the first cut happening in March. If we look at the next announcement date in April, the money markets are predicting about a 75% chance that the bank cuts their rates in April. That also came down from about 87 before. Um, but we are starting to see more of the economists saying that they're actually now expecting to see cuts not happen in the spring, but more towards the middle of the year, so in the summer. So if we look at June, money markets are still anticipating that at least we'll see a, a, quarter, a quarter point cut at that time. And nearly at the end of the year, we should see about 1.25 based on how the money markets are behaving right now. Um, and then hopefully it'll continue after that. But that's where things are sitting right now. 